These bad boys can make your photography game skyrocket. Hey, what's up guys? Hope you're having an awesome day today. Today's video is main, mainly based on for those who want to get started in photography but only have either their phone or their phone and just a couple of dollars. He's done. And I'm not just talking about pictures of your default phone camera, I'm talking about these bad boys. These bad boys can make your photography game skyrocket. Okay, so this particular lens case I got comes with a wide angle, a fisheye, and a macro lens, which is kind of a lens that have different effects on different images. So I'm actually gonna take you around my yard, take some pictures, and show you what you can do with these. Yeah. So the first lens I'm using is the wide angle lens. And this bad boy, it does, it does what it sounds like, it makes your image wider. So here's a picture I took, it actually was my, with my regular phone camera, no wide angle lens. Now here's the picture I took with the wide angle lens of the same scenery. Big difference, right? Now this can be used for what? Photography and videography. I know, I actually, if you go back a long, long time ago, on my old Jack David channel, you guys, some of you I have maybe OGs in my YouTube career, my very first YouTube video, I introduced myself on my, on my iPhone 7 with this wide angle lens. I actually was recording on that. You can kind of tell on the outside, there's a little bit of like a black circle, I guess you could say. But yeah, next lens. Now, the next lens we're talking about is the fisheye lens. The fisheye lens is actually one of my all time favorites. So, pretty much, the fisheye lens puts you in this little globe. So, you have a black outline all around you, and you are in a circle. As you guys just saw. Now here's a picture I took without the lens, and here's one I took with the lens. Like I said, one of my favorites. Now, last but not least, macro lens. Now, last but not least is the macro lens. The macro lens pretty much makes anything small look more detailed. So, as you guys look at this clip right now, this is my microphone on top of my camera, the real microphone. And you see how all like, the itty bitty black particles of the actual foam part are sticking out? That's what it does. So, I'm gonna take a picture of this flower here without the lens and then with the lens. This is also one of my favorite lens. You know what, scratch all of that. All three of my lens, all three of the lenses that I have are my favorite. So. Taking pictures on a phone is very different if you're, if you're used to taking them on an, a DSLR. Also the fact that your phone is half the size of your DSLR. Now it kind of takes you down memory lane a little bit because when I first started out with photography and YouTube, it was on my iPhone 6S. Funny how things change. Now it's time for question of the day. This question is from Kelvin Keys, a good friend of mine actually, a beast at hockey. Can you give me some advice on how to start photography? Easy. So my biggest piece of advice for you is just go out and start. See something cool, take a picture of it. You don't have to get all fancy with um, reflection and blurry backgrounds and all this stuff. Just go out and take a picture. Take a picture of your grandma, okay? I've met your grandma, take a picture of your grandma. That's not weird. Like me. Go out under your yard, take pictures of grass, flowers. They're, they're cool. Or, I'm actually gonna leave a link to this pack of lenses and some other ones from Amazon in the description below so you guys can buy them for yourself. But yeah, just go out and start, Kelvin. I know there's a whole lot more. Look up on videos on some on YouTube. I know I have. I'm making some more videos on how to actually get started with photography, which might help you. But yeah, just go out and start. Anyway, if you like this video, consider liking and subscribing. Your choice. You know what to do. It's been a pleasure hanging out with you guys, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.